what's up everybody so let's talk about dj academics so y'all know i made a video about dj academics stating that he felt like the cd girls will be over soon because they are lazy and they do not write their raps so carisha did respond saucy santana responded as well and so dj academics he responds to saucy santana's video and DJ Academics, I don't care how hard you was trying to go in your video. You did not convince me that you would do anything to Saucy Santana if he actually pulled up. Like you was going so hard. Like you was trying to make people believe that you would do something. I don't think you would, sir. And who knew that DJ Academic was Jamaican? I didn't even know that <laughs> until this here video. Like, I mean, I really don't follow him like that because he just too... From what I be seeing, he, he just loves to talk about women. He loves to call women bitches, hoes, and stuff like that. And I really don't be, ugh, you know. So, but anyway, y'all, look at this video. Tell me if he is convincing that he would actually fight somebody i don't even think this ninja would fight any dude and let's not even sit up here and say that okay saucy is a gay man but y'all gotta understand he's still a man at the end of the day and i've seen gay men fight okay i've seen some gay men beat up straight men so let's <laughs> it don't matter if he gay or not or whatever you call him boxy mind it don't matter it does not matter I put my bets on Saucy. <laughs> I, my bets is on Saucy. But anyway, y'all, let's look at this video of DJ Academics trying to go off honey. Fuck y'all and your fucking Batman best friend. Because me ain't a no Batman thing. You's a Batman man, you know, deal. Period. I can't even say what I really want to say. Because, you know, I'm telling you, my heart was... I was born in Spanish Town Hospital in Jamaica, nigga. I grew up and I seen the worst things in my life. When I came over here, I had to be tolerant of Bati boys like motherfucking Saucy Santana. Nigga like that would never, I swear, if he was in Jamaica, man, I swear he would never be able to speak like this to me without real repercussion. But of course, we in America, so everybody exists. So I gotta smile, I gotta laugh, and this is cool. But when you're talking about you looking for me, Bati boy, I mean, I know Bati one thing. So when you're looking for me, just make sure you, you realize. You just playing this internet game. Because if you really want to know where I'm at, nigga, 888, nigga, Newark Avenue, Jersey City, New Jersey, nigga. That's where my headquarters is. I've been saying this mad times. You show up there with any type of disrespect, any type of body man vibes, and it's going to be a fucking movie. Fuck y'all. It even works for you because I'm telling you, I don't deal with body man thing, dog. You as a person, you as an entity, the way you exist, the person you are, the spirit you are, nigga. Only thing I could ever do is pray for a nigga like you. But if you want to really try to get it in, I'm telling you where I'm at, nigga. Straight up, we can get it up. You don't want to do it. Don't tell me to come to your party. Fuck Carisha. Diddy ain't finna say nothing to me. Fuck you, nigga. You pull up to where I'm at. I'm telling you where I'm at. Nigga, why, why am I walking around looking for a fucking body one? You come look for me if you got a problem. The address don't change. The timing don't change. You can communicate to me directly. But I bet you won't do that because what you think you finna come do there, it's not gonna happen there. I got a great ass, I got a great ass surprise of what, what, what the itinerary gonna be. I show up there. I get this address now. Wait, first of all, even worse, so I don't even like getting into a box too much because you probably trying to come up there and suck everybody up, nigga. Gay nigga, like the fuck we gotta talk about? Boy, your own, your own best friend don't respect you, nigga. You over here trying to talk about respect, nigga. Your best friend don't respect you. She's a hoe. Your whole best friend don't respect you. Like, come on, nigga. Like, boy, I don't care what. Your whole best friend don't respect you. She's a side chick, nigga. Getting piped out by, like, all type of niggas. Billionaire pissing on her type shit. She don't respect you. But you trying to ride for her? Yo, you a, come on, nigga. If she don't respect you, nigga, because that's why she's saying certain, these type of things, Yo, when y'all say gay shit or whatever to me, that shit bounce off me because we don't like Batman. Straight up. That's why I don't even like giving it to a Batman because you probably trying to come there and suck everybody up, nigga. Gay nigga like the fuck we gotta talk about. Boy, your own, your own best friend don't respect you, nigga. You over here trying to talk about respect, nigga. Your best friend don't respect you. She's a hoe. Your whole best friend don't respect you. Like, come on, nigga. Like, 
But I don't care what your <gasps> whole best friend don't respect you. She's a side chick, nigga. Getting piped out by like all type of niggas. Billionaire pissing on hers type shit. She don't respect you. But you try to ride for her, you, yo, you a, come on, nigga. If she don't respect you, nigga, because that's why she's saying certain, these type of things. Yo, when y'all say gay shit or whatever to me, that shit bounce off me because we don't like Batman. Straight up. So I don't even like giving it to a Batman because you probably trying to come up there and suck everybody up, nigga. I'm sorry, academic. You did not eat how you thought you ate, okay? And so Saucy Santana's boo came out and he said, Man, I'll slap the dog ish out of this ninja. And he meant that. Zell Swag said that. Yes, he did. And so y'all know Saucy had to come back out. And so Saucy said, Sir, we're not meeting you at nobody's headquarters. We trying to meet you out on the street because we are hood and that's what hood people do. Fight on the streets. You see what type of nigga we dealing with right now? Put up to your headquarters. 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 Niggas is in the street. I want to be in the road. Yo, headquarters. Nigga, what the fuck is somebody need? That's your headquarters for. That's a problem. See, I think I'm starting to think that maybe this is your aesthetic. You do the fake internet shit. And then you and you sit in a room full of motherfucking cameras and try to make a bitch crash out. You know, that's like, we're from the hood. Oh, yeah, that's how you tell the bitch, uh-huh, come in my house. Come in my house, because I can do whatever I want to see. I mean, I, you don't have to, me, you can meet, we, we, we want to meet you outside. I want to meet you outside. I don't want to put up to that motherfucking headquarters, bitch. Corporate ass nigga. I don't want to put up to that motherfucking headquarters. I want to meet you in the club. I want to meet you in the field. I want to meet you in the street. I want to see you outside. Okay, so I had to change your voices just a little bit because I am technically still in YouTube prison and YouTube do not condone violence or anything like that. So I got to be careful on what I post because the last video I posted about DJ Academics, they actually limited my monetization on that. So I'm trying to be careful on what I post. But, honey, listen, all I got to say is this. My bets is on Saucy Santana, right? I don't believe for one second that academics would do anything, right? And, honey, all Saucy got to do is take them long-ass nails off and get in them streets. And I, I guarantee you, he got, he got academics. I don't care what nobody say. He got them. He got him. <laughs> So what do y'all think about DJ Academics over here trying to be uh, rough and tough and trying to say that he could, um, I guess, fight Saucy Santana, honey? And what y'all think about Saucy coming back and saying, let's go to the streets, baby. We talking about in the streets, right? 
So y'all know what y'all gotta do. Comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Share this video. Like this video. And y'all know what y'all gotta do. Stay tuned for the next video. Bye.